Uh, my own man is doing great out there. I mean, the first two races, the first race he did great. You know, the second time come back and win, so that was great. The race to start, you know, I got kind of carry white a little bit around the first turn. You know, I didn't want, I didn't have the perfect trick like I wanted it to. But uh, to be honest with you, I mean, I'm looking forward for him to run huge. Uh, it's coming up Saturday, and uh, you know, fingers crossed. You know, he's doing well, and we'll see what happens. Louisiana Derby is a mile and three sixteenths for the first time, which is. Uh, you know, r rare before right. the Kentucky Derby. Right. Does this help them? Does this is this an unknown? Uh, I mean, it's fine. Honestly, with you, I ain't worried about the distance. I mean, I just want to make sure that I finish up running when I'm in and uh, try to do a good performance. Honestly, you know. Now we're in very strange times. Um, you know, this meet's going to continue without fans, but then Keeneland's been canceled. What's it like for a, a jockey? I mean, where do you go after this? Uh, Honestly, we, you know, see, we sit in a cloud, you know, we never know what's going to happen. Uh, you know, we go day by day, you know, everything changes every different day. So we'll see what happens from here and there. I mean, I go with the flow and uh, I do whatever I need to do. And then, uh, I guess it's just big that this meet is running because, um, you know, Maryland canceled. Some tracks have canceled. A yeah, lot of running still. Already, you know, we had a luck that we kind of still doing it, and uh, we continue to doing it as long as we can. You know, as long as it let us. As long as you've been in racing, I imagine you wanted to to win the big race the first Saturday in May. Did you ever think the big race would be the first Saturday in September? In September, you know, it's kind of weird, but um, it is what it is. You know, but everything's going on around the world right now. Sometimes it's best to be safe than sorry. So we got from there.